Hello guys, once again it's Matt and today we have another video, thank you all the members of the Patreons, make sure to subscribe and let's get into it guys. What is happening? Challenger 3 was confirmed. <laughs> I didn't even know this was a thing actually, I mean, I did know but I wasn't really sure that it was uh, actually being built or anything like that, so it's kind of a surprise for me, I gotta be honest. Uh, so yeah guys, Challenger 3 prototype is coming for War Thunder. So what is the Challenger 3? Well, it is pretty much a Challenger 2, but it is the latest modification of it. That's pretty much what it is. It is not in service right now. It's to be started, to be produced produced uh, during 2024. I think it probably al already is, right? And it is uh, probably going to enter service in 2027. So it's a tank that is not in service yet, but uh, they managed to get um, like a um, a prototype in the game that was presented in 2019, if I'm not mistaken, for the MOD for the UK, right? So it is pretty interesting, guys. It is, as I said, the pretty much the same tank as we already know and love or hate because a lot of people hate these tanks. I really find them quite amusing to play um, yes they have their limitations but they are very you know steady in the way that you can use them if that makes sense uh, but this one it really has two things that are very very much amazing things um, first things first is that it doesn't use the 1200 horsepower engine anymore it uses a 1500 one so uh, similar to something like a leopard 2 so the mobility it should be a lot better, even though it has pretty much the same uh, top speed, 59 kilometers per hour, it should accelerate much, much faster, uh, which means that this tank will actually be a lot more competitive to get to places and stuff like that. Uh, not that the 1200 horsepower engine was like problematic, but uh, 1501 was kind of needed uh, if they want to be competitive with other nations in the mobility department, right? But the main thing is, yes, the gun, guys. Uh, it's the first non-rifled gun for the British uh, in the NBT, I think. So, yes, it has a L55, guys, the same type of gun that it's used in the Leopards 2A6, for example, and H2A7, right? So it is a smoothbore um, gun, guys. Finally, a smoothbore in the British uh, tank lineup. Uh, it loses, of course, the hash and the smoke rounds because of that, but it is going to be um, using the DM53 round as well, and it has the HE uh, with the fuse. So uh, it is very, very interesting, guys. Imagine a Challenger 2, but with more power and a L55. This is, like, crazy good, I think. And then, of course, it has third-generation thermals, uh, better systems overall, right, internally. That doesn't matter too much uh, in the game because the only thing that you will feel of difference is the actual uh, thermal system and the laser warning system. So uh, that's pretty much what it is, right? Um... I, I, I was pretty sure that he had uh, an APS, but I was like, I mean, he didn't, apparently. So I don't think he will have it for now, at least. He doesn't feel like he does it. They don't talk about it. So, uh, but still, guys, this is crazy. <laughs> I mean, I'm getting back to tanks and I'm starting to play tanks again. And these things are actually making me really want to play uh, top tier tanks again. I'm uh, researching the US right now at rank 5 to 6, right? So uh, I'm pretty far away from these tanks in some of the nations, especially the UK, but um, I mean, it's very interesting. Uh, but I don't know, maybe some people will complain about this. I don't think so. I think the UK kind of needed one tank, uh, a tank like this uh, to be competitive and obviously, especially once uh, the T90M and the better Abrams and Leopards, you know, are shown as well, we will need something to deal with that because uh, the UK is kind of limited with their tanks uh, beyond the Challenger 2, right? So, yeah, uh, but very, very cool, guys. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think about the Challenger 3. I wasn't, I, I, my brain couldn't comprehend that we are going to have a Challenger 3 in the game yet, uh, but yeah. 
Uh, I see you guys in the next one. Make sure to subscribe and bye. See